I asked AI what is going to happen next in the Microsoft Activision Blizzard acquisition saga. Let's see what ChatGPT has to say. Here we have our lovely AI assistant here, ChatGPT. Hello? Hello, how can I assist you today? You can assist me by telling me as Xbox Activision Blizzard's acquisition deal is officially blocked in the UK without Activision, what does Xbox do now? Let's go. The recent news that the UK has blocked Xbox's acquisition of Activision Blizzard will certainly have a significant impact on Xbox's future plans. Without Activision, Xbox will need to look for other ways to expand its gaming portfolio and attract more players. One possibility is that Xbox could pursue other acquisitions or partnerships with game developers and publishers. There are many independent studios and smaller publishers out there that could be a good fit for Xbox's gaming platform. Who would you like to see Xbox buy instead? Let me know down below in the comments and we'll ask ChatGPT if they could be an option. By adding these companies to its portfolio, Xbox could still broaden its reach and appeal to a wider range of players. Another option is for Xbox to focus on developing and promoting its own exclusive titles. Xbox has a strong track record of creating successful franchises like Halo and Forza and it could continue to invest in these and other titles to build a diverse and compelling library of games. They could use that $60 billion and invest it into the studios they already have, that could be a good idea. Ultimately, Xbox will need to be strategic and creative in its approach to growing its gaming business. Without Activision, the gaming industry is highly competitive and there are many other players in the market vying for attention from gamers. It will be interesting to see what moves Xbox makes next in this evolving landscape. Hmm. So let's ask ChatGPT what they would do if they were in charge. Okay, here we go. If I were in charge of Xbox, I would focus on a few key areas. Invest in the development of exclusive titles. Yes, agreed. We definitely need some more of them. Xbox has a strong track record of creating successful franchises and I would continue to invest in those titles while developing new ones. Exclusive titles can be a major draw for players and they can help to differentiate Xbox from other gaming platforms. Totally agreed. I think this is where Sony and Nintendo are way ahead of Xbox right now. We've not had a lot of exclusives recently. We need some more. Expand Xbox's gaming ecosystem. Xbox already has a robust gaming ecosystem, but there's always room for growth. I would look for ways to expand the reach of Xbox's platform, such as by partnering with other companies or by introducing new features and services. Enhance the user experience. User experience is critical in gaming and I would prioritize improving the user interface, making it more intuitive and easier to use. I would also focus on improving customer support and addressing any issues that players may be experiencing. I agree with this too. The UI on the Xbox consoles currently sucks. It needs to be redone and modernized. And I think Xbox are actually working on this right now. There's a new version of the dashboard being tested where all the tiles are moved down so you can actually see your nice backgrounds a lot clearer. Embrace emerging technologies. Finally, I would explore new and emerging technologies that could enhance the gaming experience. For example, Xbox could invest in virtual reality or augmented reality technology or it could incorporate more advanced AI and machine learning features into its platform. ChatGPT is super smart, it's making itself a job here at Xbox, so Phil Spencer, all your problems will be solved, just go and hire ChatGPT. You are welcome. Overall, there are many ways that Xbox could continue to grow and evolve as a gaming platform, and I would prioritize innovation, creativity, and user satisfaction in any decisions I made. This is what ChatGPT would do if it was in charge of Xbox, but what would you do? Let me know down below in the comments, and if you've not picked up this amazing deal on Xbox Game Pass yet, make sure you check out the video on screen now.